Blog Talk Radio. Stephen B's Media Production is a part of the Shellcaster Network. Stevie B Media Production presents Acapella Gospel Music Blast with your host, Stevie B. Playing your favorite acapella music from the world's greatest acapella artist. Sit back, relax, and listen to the sweet sound of voices. We're flying at 30,000 feet, and you're riding with Stevie B. You can call into the live show, 713-955-0508, or email us, butlersteve1009 at yahoo.com. Contact us. Let us know who's riding with Stevie B on the blast tonight. This is the Acapella Gospel Music Blast, and you're listening to Stevie B. This radio show is the 2018 nominee for the NACAMA, National Academy of Christian Acapella Music Artists Award. This radio show is being broadcast from Stevie B's media production at the Carolina Studio. In the great state of North Carolina, this is Stevie B. And I'm the blaster master of acapella gospel music. And according to the late wife on the General Connor from Dayton, Ohio, she said Stevie B is the hardest working Christian DJ in the world today. May the good Lord have mercy on us all. I have a recent quote from the interview I did with Isay's Jesse Murrah from Straight Company from Louisville, Kentucky. We had him on the show as the producer of Divine Experience out of Tampa, Florida, with one of the lead vocalists of that group, Brandon P.K. Smith. And Jesse said, listen to what Isay said. I really appreciate this quote from Isay. He said, my radio voice, <laughs> my energy, my creativity is refreshing and nobody does it better because nobody's gonna outwork me. I really appreciate that. I also have a recent quote from the interview I did with Thurman Metters from Temple, Texas. He was on the broadcast. He says, Steve B is the hardest working man in acapella Christian music. That's what they say, ladies and gentlemen. I'm just telling you what they say. <laughs> I also have a quote from my dear brother, the late Irvin C. Jackson from Wesley Chapel, Florida. Uh, he was coming on the broadcast, debuting his new music on this radio show. He says, Stevie B is the greatest and the hardest working man. He said, I consider you to be the lighthouse of acapella gospel music. I certainly appreciate that quote from the late Irvin C. Jackson. I also have a quote from Mr. Uwe himself, Dorian Paul out of Houston, Texas. He's been on the show a couple of times. He says, Stevie B, we need you. We need you, Doc. Don't you go nowhere. <laughs> because we need you. That's what they say, ladies and gentlemen. I'm just telling you what they said. <laughs> Also, a quote from Jeremy Roberts from IF Virginia. We've interviewed him on the show a couple of times. He says, Stevie B is the hardest working man on the radio, period. And I have a quote from my dear brother, Anthony Blunt. He's the radio host for the Gospel Train that airs on Sunday morning on 94.7 FM, WWBC 1510 AM in Rockledge, Florida. He said the same thing during an interview on his radio show. So it must be some truth to it. And then I have a recent quote from Kenneth Ray. He sings with Made New Acapella Ensemble out of Louisville, Kentucky. He said on the broadcast, he says, Stevie B is the hardest working brother in acapella music on the ones and twos. And I also have a quote, I have a quote from the comedian Tim Pryden from right here in Fayetteville, North Carolina. He was on the show. He says, there are many great Stevie's in the world, like Stevie Wonder that has made uh, nothing but classics in the music game. But you also need to know about my guy that's killing the radio game, my guy, Stevie 
be. And then the last quote I have from Ali Ezel from Fayetteville, North Carolina. He says, Stevie B is the mouth of acapella gospel music. I like that. Stevie B's acapella gospel music class. But you can't be the blaster master if you're not dropping any bombs on your radio show. Let me get this big iron bird on up off the ground. I rubbed my two little coins together and bought me an airplane. And gentlemen, we are taking back Friday nights for the Lord. Oh, yes, we are. For the next two hours, I'm going to play some of your favorite acapella gospel songs from such artists as Straight Company, acapella, Dorian Paul, Camille Acapella Chorus, and many, many more. I want to hear from our listeners tonight. You can give me a call to the live show at 713 955 Zero five zero eight. Or you can go to the Block Talk Radio website and listen to the show live on there as well. I should used to see my show on page one or page number two uh, on the uh, website tonight. I hadn't looked at it, so I don't really know. But it's normally it's on either page one or two when I always open it up. And you can also send me an email to my new email address, Butler Steve one zero zero nine at yahoo dot com. And let me know who's riding with me on the blast tonight. I'm trying to lift up your spirits with these inspirational songs on a Friday night. Stevie B's Acapella Gospel Music On tonight's show, ladies and gentlemen, I'm counting down my top 20 acapella gospel songs for the month of June. Tonight on Stevie B's Acapella Gospel Music Blast. I will be featuring on the show tonight, my funny bones, and also my song of the week, but I will not, (laughs) I will not be doing any shout outs on the show tonight, nor will I be doing my monthly triple spin, all my old 100s due to my time restraints, I got to get to that number one song, hopefully before I go off the air, but if I don't make it, ladies and gentlemen, because I normally don't, (laughs) you can always go to the various uh, musical platforms, wherever you're getting your podcast from, and you can always listen to the show. In its entirety, if I don't make it till uh, 11 o'clock for the show tonight, because I normally don't make it, so I'm not even going to pretend anymore. (laughs) So you guys, Stevie B, loose in the booth on the ones and twos. So let's get into the music, the sweet sounds of voices. Stevie B's Acapella Gospel Music Ladies and gentlemen, during the course of the radio show tonight, I have had acapella artists on this broadcast that I've been interviewing. We've had producers. We've also had comedians and that I've interviewed on the show. And I'll be telling you what episodes they appeared on as I go through my playlist tonight. So you can go back and listen to those previous episodes if you have not had a chance to listen to those live shows uh, when they happen. And also, uh, just search for, on the the podcast, just search for Stevie B Media Production. You'll see uh, all of my shows. I have over 600 episodes on those various platforms. Now, on Blog Talk Radio, if you go to the Blog Talk Radio website and see those episodes, you'll see over 700 uh, episodes on my Blog Talk Radio site since that's my parent company. All right. Uh, wherever you're getting your favorite podcast from, Spotify, Apple iTunes, Amazon Music, YouTube, you'll see the 600 episodes on those platforms. And I also did recorded versions of these live shows here on Blog Talk Radio as well. Um, I will also tell you what episodes those recorded version shows were on as well. 
it would appear now we're having some technical difficulty we just had a storm come through here so it seems like my studio is locking up on me for whatever reason just give me a minute here ladies and gentlemen this is a live show so i'm in real time so i gotta work it out so just give me a minute here Well, I want to make my announcements on the show tonight. I do have some announcements I do need to make before I get into the music. I'll go ahead and have to improvise here and do that. I want, I have, uh, yeah, my studio just locked up on me. But let me go ahead. I don't have my other announcements available to me, but I will go ahead and announce um, what I, okay, here we go. We just came back online here. Yeah, my, my internet is messing up here. Let's see. Well, let me go ahead and make the announcements that I can make that I am aware of. I want to go ahead and announce the Acapella Experience Tour that kicks off on July the 31st in St. Petersburg, Florida. We'll be at the Historical Manhattan Casino. There'll be two shows on that particular date one the first show will be at 11 a.m and the second show will be at 6 p.m and then on april the 20th the acapella experience tour will be in birmingham alabama on september the 10th we'll be here in fayetteville north carolina we don't have a date yet for the show in memphis memphis tennessee but on september the 17th we'll be in atlanta georgia and on october the 1st we'll be in chicago illinois and then on October the 15th, we'll be in Los Angeles, California. I don't have dates yet for Memphis, Tennessee, Houston, Texas, and Phoenix, Arizona to uh, complete that tour. And also, this will be a the Chef Tables production. The promoter is Chef Brian Brown, a former member of the acapella group Just Us from Atlanta, Georgia. And these concerts will be sponsored by the Churches of Christ. Okay, I seem to have come back on line here so I can make my other announcements as well that I do want to make you aware of. Now on June the 24th, I'll be debuting uh, some new music by George G from Chicago, Illinois. And on July the 1st, my special guest on that show will be Catherine Murkison. She sings with our fellow group Bless from Birmingham, Alabama, looking forward to talking to her on this broadcast. And then on July the 23rd, my special guest is J.T. Emerson, uh, Edberson from the acapella group Exodus from Reseda, California. And on August the 5th, my special guest is Curtis Williams from Miami, Florida. We'll be debuting his new 2022 album, Whatever Comes My Way. And then on... Uh, July the 20th, there will be gospel concert featuring the North Mississippi Chorus and Basic and more at the West Oak Grove Church of Christ. And that will be in Hernander, Mississippi. I do believe, I don't have the city here, but I'm assuming, I'm sure that's where it is. And also the greatest acapella music artists, groups, and chorus will be gathered on November the 24th through the 27th at the 2022 Christian Acapella Music Festival and Awards, which will be held at the Hyatt Regency in Jacksonville Riverfront Hotel. And that address is 225 East, East Coastline Drive in Jacksonville, Florida, 32202. And you can call and make your reservations. They, they're selling tickets now. For that event, and the telephone number to call is 855-516-1090. And that will, oh, I also have on October the 14th, I have my special guests on that particular show will be Vision out of Houston, Texas, who will also be, will be headliners on the upcoming concert tour. I forgot to tell you who the headliners were going to be on that uh, concert tour, uh, Vision, uh, Rain, out of St. Petersburg, Florida. Of course, Visions out of Houston, Texas. Anissa Rebels out of Memphis, Tennessee. And Anthony Tony Carter out of Chicago, Illinois will be headliners on the upcoming Acapella Experience concert tour. So we're looking forward to putting on those shows in the coming weeks and months ahead. 
Stevie B's Acapella Gospel Music Blast. Well, who's on the playlist tonight? On the playlist tonight, I have some new singles from Teray Mack out of Jacksonville, Florida, George G out of Chi-Town, Chicago, Illinois, Monte Cuba out of Houston, Texas, Kenya Shelley from Cal- Clovis, California, uh, Dwayne Pugh and Brad MacArthur from Dallas, Texas, and many, many more. Stevie B's Acapella Gospel Music Blast. All right, ladies and gentlemen, it's time to get this show on the road. You are in the mix with Stevie B, the blast and master of acapella gospel music. Stevie B's Top 20 Countdown Show. show. Acapella gospel music. Number 20. Holding down my 20th slot for 19 weeks is Divine Experience from Tampa, Florida. They have a new single entitled Never Going Back. You're going to love this song. We did an exclusive interview with Brandon P.K. Smith and Jesse Mara Isage from Straight Company. It was on that show, episode 228. If you haven't had a chance to hear that show, go back and listen to those uh, episodes. That was a great show. Enjoy my number 20 song by Divine Experience. Number 20.
the Nisa Rebels from Memphis, Tennessee. You're listening to Stevie B's acapella gospel music plan. I thank him for the spirit. You know they help me overcome. Stevie B's acapella gospel music plan. Number 19. Rolling down my 19 slot for 77 weeks is the Melody Airs out of Houston, Texas. Their single, My Prayer, from the 2000 album, Looking Under Jesus. And this album was produced by the late Johnny Wilder Jr. We did an exclusive interview with one of the lead vocalists for the Melody Airs, episode number 99. That was Frank Melton III. Also did a recorded version of that live show here on Blog Talk Radio. That's episode number 26. Enjoy my number 19 song by the Melody Airs. Number 19. King of kings and Lord of lords, he will hear your Thank you. 
This is Orlando Tisdale, a.k.a. Mookie, and you are listening to me on Stevie B's Acapella Gospel Music Blast. Stevie B's Acapella Gospel Music Blast. Number 18. On number 18 slot for 77 weeks is our Nissan Rebels out of Memphis, Tennessee. She has a new single entitled I Know from her 2020 album Stronghold. And we debuted that album here on this broadcast, episode 179. With, and her producer, Lewis Cooper, was also on the broadcast with her uh, from the Zell Records. And that was a great show. Really enjoyed talking to them both on the show. Also, did a recorded version of that live show here on Blog Talk Radio. That's episode number. 38. Enjoy my number 18 song by Anissa Rebels. You got Stevie B on the ones and twos. Number 18. I don't know why my storm seems so tough at times, and I don't even know why I feel I'm losing my mind, and yet I know he's always there for me, and still I know. Whenever I'm in trouble, he's there. 
going on, everybody? This is Mario McKinnon coming to you from Charlotte, North Carolina, and you're listening to Stevie B's Acapella Gospel Music Blast. Y'all keep listening. For everything he's done, I got to praise the Lord. Stevie B's Acapella Gospel Music Blast. On the ones and twos, it's Stevie B, the blast of massa of acapella gospel music. Number 17. Well, I'm a 17 slot for 77 weeks. It's Camila Chorus out of Rogersville, Alabama. Their single, Be Encouraged, from their 2017 album, We're Not From Here. We debuted that album here on this broadcast, episode number 23. Also did a recorded version of that live show here on Blog Talk Radio. That's episode number nine. Also did a marathon show for Committed, episode number 49. And the recorded version for that show was episode number 16. Enjoy my number 17 song by Camila Fellow Courage. You got Stevie B on the ones and twos. Number 17. All right. Uh, brothers and sisters, we came to lift you up, to encourage you, to open up the word of God and stop Leaning on your own understanding. Come on, committed. I need you. Brother. Uh-huh. Have you seen the fight? Don't you give up. Encourage. Oh, no. 
1-800-273-9432. Hey, this is Dorian Paul, and you're listening to Stevie B's Acapella Gospel Music Blast. Ooh-wee. Stevie B's Acapella Gospel Music Blast. Stevie B's Good day, family. It's your boy, George G, a.k.a. George G International, G-G-I-G to the double E. You're listening to the phenomenal sounds of a cappella gospel music blast where the bass note bumps and the E note jumps and the sopranos and the altos and the tenors make you sway. Oh, yeah, it's a head knocker, baby. And a rock and cheer rocker, a cappella gospel music blast, your host. Stevie B, spinning the voices that soothe the soul, flying at 30,000 feet, not missing a beat. Acapella, gospel, music blast. Stevie B's acapella, gospel, music blast. Stevie B's song of the week. We'll be dedicating this feature to my dear sister and friend, the late Linda Dilly from Tulsa, Oklahoma. She was a member of of my staff here at Stevie B's Media Productions from the year 2016 to June of 2021. She wrote all the questions for the artists that we interviewed on this radio show, and we just want to keep her memory alive on this radio broadcast. Stevie B's Song of the Week. This week we are featuring the Acapella Vocal Band featuring Joyce B. from Chicago, Illinois, and Acapella Vocal Band was out of Nashville, Tennessee, and of course, George G., will be my special guest on the broadcast next Friday night. And this single that we're featuring for the Acapella Vocal Band is Lamb of God. Enjoy my song of the week. Stevie B's Song of the Week.
Stevie B's Song of the Week. Stevie B's Acapella Gospel Music Blast. So we're driving back, and I asked my uh, son, now that you're out of the military, you've had six years to think about it, what are your plans? And he said, well, I was kind of hoping I could move back home while I reacclimate to civilian life. I said, so you haven't thought about it, have you? <laughs> he said, no. I said, all right. Well, you've earned it. Take all the time you need. <laughs> Nineteen months into the acclimating process. My wife grabs me in the hall one afternoon. How long does it take to acclimate? I said, I don't know. I never had to. Go downstairs and talk to that boy. So I went downstairs. I uh, politely asked my 26-year-old son, pause your video game. I need your full attention on this one. (laughs) Mom and I were a little curious. Did the Army teach you a skill, something you can use to get employment and move out? I want you to understand something, young man. Your mother and I want grandchildren. We've earned grandchildren. And we worship a God of miracles. We believe out of three billion women on this planet, God has chosen one of those women for you to breed with. (laughs) We just don't think she's going to fall through our vent and land in your lap down here in the basement. (laughs) So did you learn anything? He thought about it. He said, you know, I could kill you six ways with a popsicle stick. (laughs) All right. You enjoy that video game, my man, and <laughs> let mom and I know when you're done doing that acclimating thing. <laughs> so I run upstairs, and Tammy says to me, How, what'd he say? He said, get rid of the fudge sickles, because he's going on a diet. That's what he said. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I don't know. I don't know if the Army fed him for six years. He was literally eating us out of house. My wife and I started hiding food in our bedroom to keep it from our son. I'm not lying. That's pathetic. It really is. We had a stash of brownies and muffins in the nightstand next to our bed. So late at night, we get all excited, run down the hall, hold hands, lock the bedroom door. And I'm sure he thought we were doing something else. But we, were, we were just under the covers eating brownies and laughing at him. Yeah, yeah. Really, you hit 50, your life gets pathetic. It really does. The, the brownies are here. Woo-hoo! We'd, we'd run down the hall, lock the door. Hurry, he's going to smell these and want one. I know it. They're ours. They're not his. And the truth be known, that's all we do in our bed anymore anyway is eat. We, uh, really, we bought a select comfort bed. I don't know if you're familiar with it, but each side of the bed has its own number. The higher the number, the harder the mattress. My side of the bed, 100. Marble slab. That's it. <laughs> Tammy's number is two. First night she laid on her side of the bed, she literally disappeared from my view. <laughs> Mattress wrapped around her like a flour tortilla. <laughs> Poor thing was sleeping in a fajita on her side of the bed. So I roll over to kiss her goodnight. I fall into a ditch. I can't get out. I'm like laying there. 
she's going, get off of me. What are you doing over here? Get off of me. By the way, if you're a newlywed, that's the sound of 32 years of love right there. Yeah. Yes. You're on my hair. You haven't shaved. Your breath smells. Stop touching me. Ah. Don't get me wrong. We still try to get romantic. We just save it for special holidays now. <laughs> Turns out Tammy's favorite is leap year. Yeah. yeah. I didn't even know that was a holiday. I really didn't. I'll dim the lights and put on some Sade, and Tammy says, wow, has it been four years already? <laughs> All right, I'll get the good flannel and the hunting socks on tonight. So. <laughs> nah, we're married. We try. We just, we just know how much time and energy it actually takes, and we prefer to watch Law & Order. That's just, <laughs> just the way it's worked out. My wife falls asleep at 9.15 every night. You could set a watch by her body. At 9.10, you look at her on the couch in our living room, it's like a gas leak goes off. It's... <laughs> Sweetheart, maybe you should go to bed. Oh, I'm fine, I'm fine, I'm fine. <laughs> what are you, a five-year-old? Quit fighting it. Just go to bed. <laughs> Will you be quiet? This is my favorite show. Poor woman seen the beginning of every Law and Order for five seasons. <laughs> and now they come out and rerun, and she's yelling at me. I've seen this one. Well, give it 20 minutes. <laughs> Stevie B's Funny Bones. <laughs> Your captain speaking. I hope you're enjoying the flight tonight on the blast. I'm playing some of the world's greatest fellow gospel music artists, the sweet sounds of voices. We're flying 30,000 feet and I'm dropping bombs everywhere. Live for 77 weeks is Tiffany Malone from Athens, Alabama. Her single Let Nothing Turn Me Around from the 2011 album Reasons Why. We did an exclusive interview with Tiffany here on this broadcast, episode number seven. Enjoy my number 16 song by Tiffany Malone. Number 16. There's a story of an old sister who would come to church every Sunday. It was pain aching in her body. She would struggle from the back of the church all the way to the front pew, sometimes with tears streaming from her eyes. And one day, one of those young sisters got beside her sister. And she told that old sister, sister, if you're in so much pain, why don't you just turn around and just stay home sometime? That old sister just held her Bible closed and said these words. As I read. Story of old, and I look at old man Joe. She had lost everything that he had in just one day. Now can't you see a man he spoke with his wife when she said, "You ought to curse your God and die." I can't. 
Before I take it back, I'll add more stuff about those Hebrew boys. Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego, when the king said, better bow down before that image that day. Well, those boys were scared of the fire. Hey, they looked the king dead in their eyes with no fear. Countdown show. Down show. Acapella gospel music. Number 15. Holding down my 15 slot for 77 weeks is the Mario Brothers out of Jacksonville, Florida. Their single, Pick Me Up, and also have a remix from their 2015 album, The Mario Brothers. Did an exclusive interview with Mario McKinnon on this broadcast, episode 175. Enjoy my number 15 song by the Mario Brothers. You got Stevie B. On the ones and twos. Number 15. 
Lord, you picked me up when I was down. Lord, you planted my feet on solid ground. Lord, I once was blind, but now I see. Oh, Lord, dear Lord, look down on me. Lord, you picked me up. Bible yeah, says in First Peter 2 and verse 9, But ye are a chosen generation, a royal priesthood, a holy nation, a peculiar people, that ye may show forth the praises of him who hath called you out of darkness and into his marvelous light. Love and Savior, oh my dear God, look down on me, Lord, when times get hard. Show me the way, show me your power, you seem to pick me up in my darkest hour. This is my prayer, this is my plea, when I'm struggling, you comfort me. I know you will deliver right on time, cause you'll pick me up, Lord, when I'm Everywhere that I go, 
And I sing with Truly Blessed out of Atlanta, Georgia. You are listening to Stevie B's Acapella Gospel Music Blast. Stevie B's Acapella Gospel Music Blast. It's your favorite DJ, Stevie B, the Blast of Master of Acapella Gospel Music. Number 14. Well, now my 14th slot for 77 weeks is One Open Christ of Louisville, Kentucky. Their new single, Make a Way. That's the title track from the 2018 album, Make a Way. And we debuted this album here on this broadcast, episode number 72. Also did an exclusive interview with one of the um, vocalists for this group, Gary Edison. That's episode 238. And that's 238 and B because we had some technical difficulty on that show, so I had to publish it in two versions. And this group is also the 2018 recipient for the Nakama New Artist of the Year. Enjoy my number 14 song by One Hope in Christ. Number 14. Obstacle after obstacle seems to happen in spectacular fashion. I'm grasping for a grip that my faith won't slip as I travel on this spiritual road trip. Up and down I go where I stop. Nobody knows, but God, he holds the future, whole wide world in his hands, my plans are not his plans, yeah.
Hello out there. This is Janice Emerson, Nashville, Tennessee, former directress of Praise Unlimited. If you want to hear the latest and you want to hear the greatest, keep your station locked in to Stevie B. Stevie B's Acapella Gospel Music Blast. Number 13. Holding down the 13th slot for 77 weeks is Dwayne Pugh and Brad MacArthur, both from Dallas, Texas. Their single, God's Music, from their 2019 album, Life in Music. And we debuted this album here on this broadcast, episode 177. Also did a recorded version of that live show here on Blog Talk Radio. That's episode number 37. Enjoy my number 13 song by Dwayne Pugh and Brad MacArthur. Number 13. I felt it down deep in my soul The kind of music that cannot be ignored, no This music, I choose it Cause it keeps me going on Girl Tony Washington from Journey Acapella, and you're listening to Stevie B's Acapella Gospel Music Blast. Stevie B's Acapella Gospel Music Blast. Number 
number 12. Number 12 slot for 77 weeks is Genesis Archer from Jacksonville, Florida. Her single, Kaya Ground, from her 2012 album, I'm a Soldier. And we did an exclusive interview with Genesis on this broadcast. She's been here a couple of times, episode number 20 and episode 198. And Genesis was also the 2019 recipient for the Acapella Music Award Female Artist of the Year and the 2016 recipient of the Nakama Best Female Vocalist and the 2014 recipient for the Nakama Artist of the Year. Enjoy my number 12 song by Genesis Archer. Number 12. You cannot change the face of
I'm Kenya Shelley from Fresno, California, and I'm listening to Stevie B's Acapella Music Blast. Number 11 slot for 77 weeks is to Ray Mack from Jacksonville, Florida. His single, Thank God. This song also features Emma Baldwin from Greensboro, North Carolina. She's a member with Teray for the group Testament Aquella Ensemble. And this single is from the 2019 EP, Rich. And we debuted this EP on this broadcast, episode 146. Enjoy my number 11 song by Teray Mack. Number 11. family what's good this is East Sage with straight company and you're listening to stevie b's acapella gospel blast the master blaster <laughs> go ahead on stevie b's acapella gospel music blast stevie b's top 20 countdown show Down show acapella gospel music number 10 well, got my 10th slot for 77 weeks is Revelations from Orlando, Florida, their single Gethsemane from their 2016 album, From the Heart. Enjoy my number 10 song by Revelation. Number 10. <laughs> Oh, 
long for you and me By the one who did a tone You see, just to show his matchless grace Jesus came down here and he took my place Can't you see him as he's praying in the garden of the Just for me Watch for me, but they heard no bitter moan. Can you believe can those believe three disciples slept? While my loving Savior, He cried, He wept. Oh, Father, oh, but if it's your will, you know that I'll do it. Said I'm ready now. Then He went a little further. Then they led him up a hill. Hung him high. from Dallas, Texas, and you're listening to Stevie B's Acapella Gospel Music Blast. Taking it back to the old school, Stevie B, the blast master of Acapella Gospel Music. Number nine. On down my ninth slot for 77 weeks is Dar Barnett from Los Angeles, California. His single, Why, from his 2018 album, Way to Go. And this song was the recipient, there was a recipient for this song, was the 2018 Nakama Song of the Year. We, we debuted that album here on this broadcast, episode number 61. Also did a recorded version of that live show here on Blog Talk Radio. It's episode number eight. And now, uh, Daryl is also a former member of the acapella group New Image out of Nashville, Tennessee. Now he's an active member of the acapella group Straight Company from Louisville, Kentucky. Enjoy my number nine song by Daryl Barnett. Number nine. Dress, I got the pressure. There's a new pill I saw. 
today. I'm hypocritical. Nothing is wrong. Take a picture and just smile. But it's coming after a while. ASAP in Durham, North Carolina, and you're listening to Stevie B's A Cappella Gospel Music Blast! Stevie B's A Cappella Gospel Music Blast! Number 8 Holding down my number 8 slot for 77 weeks is Anthony Tony Carter and Craig Harding from Chicago, Illinois. Their new single, Daily Bread. You're going to love this song. Enjoy my number 8 song by Anthony Carter and Craig Harding. Number eight. This time, the storm, well, it brought me down to my knees, and I pray, Father, please, have mercy, Lord, cause I'm almost dead, and every morning, 
morning when I would arrive. I did not think I could face another day. But I made it because you fed me. My, 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 my daily Yeah, oh, see when I needed faith, God it fed me. Oh, 
Peace and love, everyone. This is your girl, Genesis Archer from Jacksonville, Florida. And you're listening in to Stevie B's Acapella Gospel Music Blast. Stevie B's Acapella Gospel Music Blast. Good day, family. It's your boy, George G, a.k.a. George G International, G-G-I-G to the double E. You're listening to the phenomenal sounds of a cappella gospel music blast where the bass note bumps and the E note jumps and the sopranos and the altos and the tenors make you sway. Oh, yeah, it's a head knocker, baby. And a rock and cheer rocker, a cappella gospel music blast, your host. Stevie B, spinning the voices that soothe the soul, flying at 30,000 feet, not missing a beat. Acapella, gospel, music blast. Stevie B's Acapella, gospel, music blast. Stevie B's Song of the Week. We'll be de- dedicating this feature to my dear sister and friend, the late Linda Dilly from Tulsa, Oklahoma. She was a member of my staff here at Stevie B's Media Productions from 2016 to June of 2021. She wrote all the questions for the artists that we interviewed on this radio show, and we just want to keep her memory alive on this radio broadcast. Stevie B's Song of the Week. This week we are featuring the acapella vocal band featuring George G. from Chicago, Illinois, and the acapella vocal band is out of Nashville, Tennessee. And the single is coming from their album, Stepping on a Cloud. And, of course, George G. will be my special guest on the show on next Friday night, June 24th. Enjoy this single for my song of the week entitled Lamb of God. You got Stevie B. on the one thing. Stevie B.'s Song of the Week.
Stevie B's Song of the Week. Stevie B's Acapella Dance Floor Music Blast. You are in the mix with Stevie B, the blast and master of acapella gospel music. Number seven. Well, now my seven slot for 77 weeks of shitting a chorus out of Houston, Texas. They have a new single entitled Sounds of Love. You're going to love this song from the 2020 EP, Surrounded by Love, featuring Frank Melton III, formerly of the Melody Airs. Enjoy my number seven song. You got Stevie B on the ones and twos. Number seven.
Crystal Stevenson from Greensboro, North Carolina. Hey, this is Amber Baldwin from Greensboro, North Carolina. This is Dodge Burnett coming from Charlotte, North Carolina. Hey, this is Teray Mack out of Jacksonville, Florida, representing Duval. We are the one and only Testament Acapella, and you're listening to Stevie B's Acapella Music Blast. With you is where I want to If you want to live, you don't make some money. My aunt passed away down in Norfolk, Virginia. Her funeral was eleven thousand dollars, eleven grand. And doctors are talking about black people are living longer. I guess so. We can't afford to die at these prices. <laughs> Our brother better hold on. Eleven thousand dollars? That's why black people don't commit suicide. So if you want to kill yourself, you got to save up for it first. Nobody got eleven grand laying around. She got, a, she got an insurance policy for $500. <laughs> Walk into a funeral home with $500. They wouldn't put your hand in the dirt for $500. <laughs> you couldn't lay away nobody for $500. Why don't you upgrade the policy? Yeah, 50 years ago you could burn somebody for $500. Not today. Upgrade the policy. <laughs> she smoked Newport cigarettes and she drank Sprite. <laughs> so at her funeral, her daughter put a can of Sprite and a pack of Newport cigarettes in a casket with her mama. I'm sitting in the back of the church going, this got to be the craziest mess I've seen in my life. <laughs> they got her, they she laying the casket dead, and then they got her hand up like this, like, <laughs> like she doing a commercial <laughs> for Sprite and Newports. <laughs> she looked like Weekend at Burning. She up there. <laughs> Why would you bury your mama holding a can of Sprite and a pack of Newport cigarettes? <laughs> and you know, and, and they didn't even, they didn't even bury the woman. I can't even make this stuff, but they didn't bury the woman. They cremated her. And the first Thanksgiving dinner, after she was cremated, her daughter brings her to the Thanksgiving dinner. Now, don't nobody want to say nothing to her, because, you know, she just lost a mama, and she's mourning over mama, you know. You know, don't nobody want to say, look, uh, look, Wanda, uh, you know, we all sorry about your mama and everything, but, you know, we, we trying to have dinner here, you know, and, um, you know, you, you got your mama sitting on top of the table there, baby, you know, and, you know, no disrespect, but... You know, she got her mama sitting there right by the salt and pepper shaker. <laughs> like she's a condiment. I thought the woman was some oregano. I like to sprinkle on my food. I'm like, look, Wanda, get your mama off the table, baby. A label or something. <laughs> Somebody gonna think she's an ashtray and it's gonna really be ashes to ashes. Get your mama off the table, baby. Put in the sink. I don't know what you wanna do with it. You know Oh, man, everybody going back to school nowadays, right? That's the thing. Go back to school. More education, more money. At least that's the way it's supposed to work. You know? Yeah, that's the way it's supposed to work. 
you know. I got a friend of mine who works for the airlines, and she's taking a Spanish class because she wants to be bilingual. She was telling me, she said, you know, Joe, if you learn how to speak Spanish, you can make a lot of money. I'm like, well, Spanish people speak Spanish, and they can't make no money speaking it. <laughs> TVB's Funny Bones. <laughs> Captain speaking. I hope you enjoyed the flight tonight on the blast. I'm playing some of the world's greatest acapella gospel music artists, the sweet sounds of voices. We're flying 30,000 feet, and I'm dropping bombs everywhere. For 19 weeks is Monte Cuba from Houston, Texas. He has a new single entitled Through the Storm, his 2020 album Learning. We debuted that album here on this broadcast, episode 190. He also did an exclusive interview with Monte on the show. Enjoy my number six song by Monte Cuba. Number six. Through the Storm.
have to cry. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Hey y'all, this is Stephanie Booker Wilson of Stephanie Sings Vocal Studio, and you're listening to the Acapella Gospel Music Blast with Stevie B. Boom, boom, baby. I needed you to reach out and take my hand and guide me, Lord. Guide me, Lord. It's Stevie B, the Blast of Massa of Acapella Gospel Music. Stevie B's Top 20 Countdown Show. Countdown show. Acapella Gospel Music. Number 5. Pulling down my number 5 slot for 19 weeks is Call by God. <laughs> Call by God, a fellow somewhere out of Nashville, Tennessee. Their single, Yes, is on the way. This song features Dwayne P. from Dallas, Texas. And we debuted this 2019 album from For His Purpose on episode 134. Also, the recorded version of that live show here on Blog Talk Radio. It's episode number 32. Now, remember, ladies and gentlemen, you can only hear these recorded versions on iHeartRadio, on Deezer, and also on Amazon Music. Enjoy my number five song by Carl by God. <laughs> number five.
This is Cool as Debris. And you are listening to Stevie B, the master blaster of acapella gospel music. Stevie B's acapella gospel music blast. Number four. Holding down my fourth slot for 19 weeks is Vision. Out of Houston, Texas, they have a new single entitled Beautiful. I just love this song. Enjoy my number four song by Vision. You got Stevie B on the ones and twos. Number four. Each morning is a gift. Do your best to make the most of it. Maybe a smile or a kind deed Helping someone who is in need Can you imagine what we could do If you help me and I help you too It would be like water to a thirsty soul And every day we'd make beautiful Whoa This is Jeremy Roberts, singer of No Mistakes and album I Forgive You, and you're listening to Stevie B's Acapella Gospel Music Blast. Stevie B's Acapella Gospel Music Blast. 
number three. Holding down my number three slot for 19 weeks is the sole influence out of Houston, Texas, their single. That's all I think about from their 2007 album, You Gotta Believe. Did an exclusive interview with two of the original members, Marcus Bonham and Monte Cuba, both from Houston, Texas. That was episode 176. Enjoy my number three song by the Soul Influence. Number three. Mama told me years ago, seek Jesus and don't let go. That's all I think about. That's all I'm thinking about. looking for God to give you a song to sing, 
like Jesus, then you tuned into the right place. You're listening to Stevie B on the Acapella Gospel Music Blast. Stevie B's Acapella Gospel Music Blast. Dropping the beat. Beat, beat, beat. Stevie B, the blast of master of acapella gospel music. Number two. Oh, now my number two slot for 19 weeks is one of my power groups, Straight Company, from Little Good Picker Dad. New single, Dreamers, from their 2020 album, AMG, Amazing, Magnificent, Godly. We debuted that album here on this broadcast, episode 181. Now, this uh, CD has two. CD box sets, 21 tracks. That's right, ladies and gentlemen, 21 tracks. It took them 10 years to produce this album. Now, some of the members of Straight Company that was on the show with me when we debuted the album was Jay Walk, The Rose, Gunsmithy, and Issei, Jesse Mara, and Darrell uh, Bonnet D. Blow. Enjoy my number two song. You're going to love this song. This song also features Chris Turner, by the way. Enjoy my number two song by Straight Company. You got Stevie B on the ones and two. Number two. The best Jamaican accent you ever heard in your life. There's so many things going on in this world today. So many things that are going on. Most of them good, but we have a lot of bad So we have to help each other out. If we don't help each other out, how are we going to make the world a better place? So that's what I'm telling to you right now. Let's make everything a better for you. Better for me, yeah, better for the whole world. All right? Yeah, man. The straight nation. We can hear you, man. Yeah. Yeah. All right, man. <laughs> These are the people that need the godly godly man, the godly woman, the godly child. Hey, Kingston. Monty, go back. Move it. Put on the ground and put your hands. Here we go. It's time for a new beginning. A new song. A new spirit. So overwhelming. Extending our hands to the street. We got to
everybody clap your hands, y'all. What's up, everybody? This is Bruce. This is Demario. This is Cranston. This is Tori. And this is Jordan. We, we are Rain. And you're listening to CDB. Well, ladies and gentlemen, according to the clock on the wall, it's time for me to bring this big iron bird on down to the ground. I need to bring it on down. I need to bring it. On down. This is the part of the show where I have to say good night. I got to go. I really enjoy playing these inspirational songs and tickling your funny bone. I want to thank my listeners for riding with me on the blast tonight. You cannot deny what you're on the blast on a Friday night. I'm playing some of the world's greatest acapella gospel music artists, the sweet sounds of voices. Stevie B's acapella gospel music blast. But I want to thank most of all the God of heaven through our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ for allowing me the privilege, and it is indeed a privilege, maybe to spend this time with you on a Friday night. So until we meet again, may God continue to bless your lives and may bless you real, real good. You've been listening to Stevie B's Acapella Gospel Music Blast. Stevie B's Acapella Gospel Music Blast. Let me hit you with three pieces before I get on up out of here. Peace, peace, peace. <laughs> now, I'll see you, Lord Say So, on the other side. My number one song for the month of June. Let's see, what is it going to be? What's that number one song? <laughs> Stevie B's Top 20 Countdown Show. Down show. Acapella Gospel Music. Number one. Over my number one slot for 19 weeks is the chant from the Bay Area, San Francisco, California, her single In Reverse. I just love this song. This is one of the 2018 EP, La Chant Acapella, and this song is produced by Coronel Clark from, Sat- from Pasadena, California. You're going to love my number one song. It's by the chat. It's Stevie B. Let me time for me to get on the body. I got to go, ladies and gentlemen. I'm way over time. <laughs> I'm Stevie B. And I'm out. Enjoy my number one song by La Chan. Why not? <laughs> Oh, and
present and commit my heart to trust in you. I thought if I ordered my steps in your way, I'd be protected and never Countdown show. Down show. Acapella gospel music. You've been listening to Stevie B's Acapella Gospel Music Blast. Episode 265. Stevie B's Acapella Gospel Music Blast.